There is a new police major on the force in Providence, and he has no known law enforcement experience. Mayor Lorza has tapped a recreation director to fill this new role. Kayla Fish live in our control room this morning with more details on this position and the mixed reaction to this decision. Kayla. Hey, good morning, Patrick. Michael Stevens is now one of five majors within the Providence Police Department, and he's serving as the city's first community relations and diversion services major. It's a position that was first announced back in January. Now, according to the police chief, this is a position with no uniform, no powers of arrest, and no weapon. Instead, Mayor Alorza says Stevens will, quote, continue to serve as a relationship builder, strengthening and expanding the connections between our community and police department. The move is drawing criticism from many, including Providence City Council President John Igliozzi, who says it's particularly unfair to the other trained officers on the police force. The chairman of the National Association of Black Law Enforcement Officers tells 12 News while the idea may have been correct, he says the process was wrong. If you're going to direct the activities of police officers, you need to understand fully what their job is. The selection as well shows a, a, a deep level of disrespect and demeaning uh, of the, the qualifications of each and every African-American officer that was a candidate for this position. Now, 12 News did reach out to Stevens directly for comment, but a city spokesperson tells us that he's currently on vacation and will get back to us once he returns. In the meantime, the leader of Black Lives Matter Political Action Committee is calling Stevens' appointment a step in the right direction. You can hear more on their perspective coming up in about 30 minutes from now. For now, live in the control room this morning, I'm Kayla Fish, 12 News. The newest member of the Providence Police Department drawing some criticism from within the capital city. Michael Stevens, who used to work in Parks and Rec, has been appointed by Mayor Alorza to serve as a police major. 12 News reporter Kayla Fish is joining us. And Kayla, there are some people who are seeing this as a positive move. Yeah, that's right, Danielle. The leader of Black Lives Matter Political Action Committee here in Rhode Island says the mayor took a step in the right direction when he appointed Michael Stevens, who has no known law enforcement experience, as a new major within the police department. Now, I want to take you back to January when 12 News first reported on the creation of this new position titled the Community Relations and Diversion Services Major. The position was described as someone who would build and strengthen trust within the community and aim to create inter interventions designed to reduce responses to calls that were more appropriate for specialized services like mental health. The announcement came as city leaders were discussing ways to divert certain calls away from police and to other social service agencies that might be better equipped to handle them. The leader of Black Lives Matter Political Action Committee is commending the mayor for choosing Stevens for this role. I think that this will breed a sense of comfortability with people in Providence because they know that this person has spent his entire life centered around the best interests of them. Um, and I think when people look for public safety, they look for people that they are close with and have relationships with this. Now, this decision has faced plenty of pushback as well from some within the law enforcement community and some community and city leaders as well, including the city council president, who said this move is particularly unfair to some of the other trained officers within the department who have moved up the ranks through the years. Now, 12 News has reached out to Stevens for comment on this story, but have not yet heard back. That's the latest live in the control room this morning. I'm Kayla Fish, 12 News.